I am Peyton Farsman and I am in 8th grade. For this year for science fair, I am doing how to make the perfect chocolate chip cookie. Some background to my project is that most people don't know how to make a good chocolate chip cookie and they always end up ruining it. This for this project is that some cookies will turn out either fluffy or flat depending on how much flour or how much sugar you put in each of the batches of cookies. The idea I used for all these cookies was that Magnolia Table Chocolate Chip Cookie Recipe. For this batch of cookies, I followed the recipe exactly. I did two and one half cups of all-purpose flour, one heaping teaspoon of baking soda, one and a half teaspoon of sea salt, eight tablespoons unsalted butter, two cups packed light brown sugar, two large eggs, one and one half teaspoons vanilla extract, and one and one half cup semi-sweet chocolate chips. The results for these cookies with these ingredients, the cookies turned out to be fluffy. For this batch, I added one half cups of more flour. So I, I did three cups of all-purpose flour, one heaping teaspoon of baking soda, one and a half teaspoon of sea salt, eight tablespoons of unsalted butter, two cups packed light brown sugar, two large eggs, one and one half teaspoons vanilla abstract, and one and one half cups semi-sweet chocolate chips. This batch with the more flour, the cookies turned out to be dense. For this batch, I did one half cups of less flour. So I had two cups of all purpose flour, one heaping teaspoon of baking soda, one and a half teaspoon sea salt, eight tablespoons of unsalted butter, two cups packed light brown sugar, Two large eggs, one and one half teaspoon vanilla abstract, and one and one half cups of semi-sweet chocolate chips. The batch with less flour, they the cookies turned out to be really flat. For this batch of cookies, I added one half cups more brown sugar. So there was two and one half cups of all-purpose flour, one heaping teaspoon of baking soda, one and a half teaspoon sea salt, eight tablespoons of unsalted butter, two and one half cups of packed light brown sugar, two large eggs, one and one half teaspoons of vanilla abstract, and one and one half cups of semi-sweet chocolate chips. The cookies with more brown sugar turn out to be Partly flat, but also like kind of like fluffy at the same time. For this batch of cookies, I added one and a half cups of less brown sugar. So I had two and one half cups of all purpose flour, one heaping teaspoon of baking soda, one and a half teaspoon of sea salt, eight tablespoons of unsalted butter, two one and a half of cups packed light brown sugar, two large eggs, one and one half teaspoons of vanilla abstract, and one and one half cups of semi-sweet chocolate chips. The cookies with less brown sugar turned out to be dense and big. Overall, I think my hypothesis was pretty good and pretty accurate.